Hi, I'm Arielle Major, and I'm a product owner here at Cavallo, and today I'm going to show you three ways to make emailing simple. Let's say I'm an order taker and I'm on the phone with a customer that would like to be emailed a sales confirmation. A simple way to do this would be to open up the order and email a sales confirmation right from the order itself. So let's do that. I'm going to click into a datum corporation and go into this order right here and I'm going to click this menu up here, select send email. I'm going to select Robert Towns for the email recipient, and then I'm going to select the sales confirmation here. Then I will select send email. Now let's say I'm a sales manager and I'm looking at mission control and I really need to send some emailed reports out to my customers. I can simply email reports straight from Mission Control by going to this menu to the right and selecting email reports, select a recipient, and I can send a any one of these reports here. I will send a pro forma invoice for this one and simply select send email. So we've gone over two ways to make emailing simple. Now let's say I'm a sales manager and I have a customer that would like a pro forma invoice emailed out for any order above $1,000. I can easily do this via workflow. To do this, I'm going to go to workflows, going to go to my order workflow. And then under the order details queue, I'm going to select edit and I'm going to add an alternate path here. For this alternate path, I'm going to call it a high value order to make it signify that this is a high value order. I'm going to select a field from the order where the total is more than a fixed value of 1000 and then I also only want this for a particular sales um, representative. So I'm going to select salesperson is Benjamin Chu. So then what this will do is send the orders to the next queue still. For, which is pick package, but I'm going to also add an automated action here that will send an email based on the conditions above. I'm going to send an email report, select the pro forma invoice, going to select the sales representative as the reply to, and I will send it to the primary email address for this customer. And so what we have here is if the total on the order is more than $1,000 and the salesperson is Benjamin Chu, it'll move to pick package while also sending an email automatically. And that email is sending the pro forma invoice to the customer. That was three ways to make emailing simple. If you'd like to see more videos like this, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.